one of the first impressions of life, of mine, was uh, Dad was stationed at a place called Langley Field. We lived in a, in a set of quarters where at night the, the ropes on the flagpole would blow in the wind and make clang, clang, clang. Dad put me in the back seat of a biplane, open cockpit, and away we went. And I'll never forget that as long as I live. I remember walking back to the house. I think my feet barely touched the ground. When I got there, they had still had horses at West Point. So I thought, I want to play polo. And I'm on a horse one day, and the upperclassman came up and said, get off that horse. Yes, sir. He said, what are you doing here? I said, sir, I'm going to play polo. He said, like hell you are, you're going to play football. I was sent off to fly P-38s. Went to Arizona, California. I thought I'd never get overseas. And getting there is quite a story. Poured the coal to that P-38. And I counted, there were about 55 ME-109s. I'm lining up on the tail end Charlie and the highest sort of V they had with a bunch of spares all around. And I'm about to shoot him, and both engines quit. My wife was an actress. She was doing a television show, Janet Dean, registered nurse, New York City. The backer was a good friend of the Secretary of the Air Force. He told the Secretary, don't let him go. I was so mad. I requested uh, uh, I resign. The Constitution is by, for, and of the people. That means we didn't swear to protect the President, the Houses of Congress, or anybody else except you. That made you and your forebears my bosses. I only did what you told me to do.